Jesus Loved Me is basically about this black man who was a business owner and he said that presented problems for the Klan and they wanted to bring that to an abrupt end. So they came and they drug him out of his house in front of his, his wife and children and they took him to this big field. And he knew that by the crescent moon that his life would, would end. And he said the Klan was in a big circle and that they were shouting names at him. They was in a celebratory mood. They was calling him Coon, Mucky, Nigger. And he tried to close his ears to that deafening sound. And he was determined that the last words he would hear on this earth would not be nigger. Never nigger. Never, ever nigger. Then all of a sudden, he began to hear the first song that his mother ever taught him. It's as if her voice came out of nowhere. He started hearing her soft voice beginning to sing and seemed to seal his ears that he no longer heard those disheartening sounds. And she started, Jesus loves me, this I know. And then the rope was used to tighten his flaring legs and pull them together on this tree stump. For the Bible tells me so. And his lower back held tight by this rope that was unyielding. And he felt that it was cutting his wrist. And he felt his warm blood flowing down his fingertips as his fingers became numb. Little one, to him belong. Then the rope was being lowered down his, to his neck. And it scratched his cheeks and smudged the tears that was flowing down his face. And then it nestled under his lower jaw and upper neck, and it tightened. They are weak, but he is strong. Even in the middle of the day for a nine-year-old. 